Hello traders, welcome to this Ninja Trader 8 features video. In this video, we're going to go over the level 2 window. Some of the topics we're going to go ahead and cover. Window layout and using the level 2 window and available properties. As a reminder, trading does carry significant risk and all information in this video is provided for educational purposes only and is not offer or recommendation to trade future stocks, options, or forex. To access the level 2 window, go to your control panel, go to new, go down to level 2. You'll see this window pop up here. Now it's going to go ahead and default to the ES, but you can go ahead and type anywhere and they'll say go to the NQ and hit enter and it'll go to that market here. Now let's go ahead and go over this window. At the top here you have the bid ask last open high low prior close net change and volume numbers here for the ES. Over here you have the price. You have the bid at price and the offer price, the depth, the amount of contracts available on either side, and the spread between the price. Over here on the graph, we'll show the difference between the contracts on either side of the market. Down here on the bottom left here, you have the information that's on the bid. On the right side, you have the information that's on the offer. So the ID is the market maker ID, the current price that's available, amount of contracts available to buy and sell at that current price, and the last time that this printed here. Same information can be found for the ask side here. You can link this to an instrument link, so if you go ahead and left click, you can go ahead and use one of these colors and link it to a chart or link it to another window. You can go ahead and add a new tab here. It'll go ahead and duplicate this tab this point you can go ahead and change the market that you want to go ahead and track. You can go ahead and hit the X and close the tab here as well. You can right click and again go through all the instruments here whichever instrument that you want to go ahead and track. You have the option of using tracked market makers here so you can just track a specific market maker. You can show the details, quotes, and summaries or you can turn that off. Going into properties here you can change the size of the grid font. You can change the size of the graph. Again, this is uh, the size of the contracts offered. You can go ahead and use depth of market here as well. Number of price level details is set to default to 10. You can go ahead and increase that here. Size divided by 100 for stocks only. You can go ahead and select or deselect that here. You can change the colors of any of the price levels here. The tracked market makers background and foreground, you can change the colors of that here. Uptick background and down, down tick background, you can change those backgrounds here. You can choose always on top and show tabs down here as well. 